is up guys and welcome back to a brand new edition of the Road to Glory. I seem energetic and happy and I shouldn't be because you guys saw my team. And <laughs> yeah, um, it's not going too well this weekend. Um, to say the least, I don't want to really talk about it. We have a 13 minute video I think um, to make up for the terrible gameplay you're about to see. Not terrible, but just a lot of goals scored back and forth and a lot of penalty shootouts. I think I've gone like, I played 12 games and I've gone to four penalty shootouts. Not very fun, but I did up getting Neymar for 388,000 coins on bid and he has been fantastic. Only problem is the people I'm coming up against and the goalkeepers I'm coming up against. Let me get started. First of all, goalkeepers this weekend that I play against have been insanely good for no reason at all. Great shot from Usman Dembele. That game, Buffon was ruining my life. Ruining my life. And I've came up against Buffon like four times this weekend. Don't know why, don't know who just wants to use Buffon all of a sudden, or why so many people want to use Buffon. But he's been crazy good for everyone that I play against. I don't know why. But I have been using Hugo Lloris. He has been pretty solid. Not going to lie. Better than Butlin, definitely. And I lose the game from... Uh, look, nine saves from Gianluigi Buffon, dude. Like, why? Why, 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 why? But I've been coming... Okay, so that's the first thing. Second thing, everyone that I come... Oh, look at this team, by the way. You see it and you say, okay... It, it has a lot of players off cam. I should be able to win this easily. I have he has three, uh, four, five. He has six players, seven players off of cam, and he doesn't have that good of a back line. It's decent, but not like amazing. So I go in, I get a goal on O block, and then I'm pretty sure after that, after that one shot in the 22nd minute, O block saves everything. He just, he just decided to go god mode, summon his inner inner Neuer. You know, he just. Pulled a quick prayer, a quick prayer in the middle of the game, and bang, he he's automatically over. Look at that bounce, by the way, dude. That is disgusting. That is disgusting. Why is that happening in a competitive esports ready game? EA Sports, fix it, man. Um, that's a great finish. That would be a great finish. Hugo Lori saves it. He gets a rebound goal. Doesn't deserve it. He goes up two one. What am I gonna do? I'm like, okay, two one. It's okay. Keep your composure. You can get back into this game. So, I go through with Neymar, Neymar drives down the left wing, does manage to cut back in, is going to keep going, does finesse it to the right shot, and he ties it up to 2-2. We do go to penalties once again, we go through extra time in 120th minute, and we don't get anything, so we go into extra time. Pretty sure I lose this as well, because Oblock goes god mode as well. Um, but, as I was saying, I've been coming up against opponents who love to use high pressure, and I'm pretty sure they don't go, hmm... You know, in FIFA 17, um, I'm gonna I'm gonna play high pressure. I'm gonna play a high pressure game. Like I'm 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 just like not gonna let my opponents like do this kind of stuff because um, I just want to play high pressure. That's my tactic because I'm very very tactical at this game. No, 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 no. No one does that. No one, no one does that in this game. If you play a high pressure, look at that. I thought that went in. I, I, I wanted to go under O-Block. If you play high pressure, 12 saves from O-Block, what? That's 21 saves in two games from goalkeepers. What am I going to do? What am I going to do? Okay, as I was saying, if you if you play high pressure in this game, it's most likely because you're impatient to get the ball back. Look at this team, by the way. Another easy team, right? Another easy team? I should be able to beat it? <laughs> no. Um, you should be able to beat high pressure easily because they pull out opponents so fast. But I can't, I can't play against high pressure. I can't. It's my only weakness. High, playing against high pressure players and players that have, um, defense that tackle everything. What a goal by Neymar this is, by the way. That's a fantastic goal. Great curve, great finesse shot from Neymar. But, I can't play against high pressure. I can't. It's impossible for me. It's so, super, super, super difficult for me to play against high pressure, man. I just can't handle it. I, I, I can think fast enough. I can make my passes fast enough, but I don't think my players can cooperate. That's the thing. And when you're playing with input delay and you're playing against high pressure, it's so difficult because you need to make those quick passes so you won't get intercepted. And you can't because of the high pressure. And my 
my opponents just get away with it and beat me and have the possession which means that they will get more shots at goal and if I can't break an opponent down in the first half or in the first let's say 30 minutes of a game first 25 minutes of a game if I can't break an opponent down in the first 25 30 minutes of a game I'm most likely not going to break them down for the rest of the game unless I get really really lucky or I get a counter attack or something because I am good at breaking opponents down and kind of like thinking what they're going to think about what I'm going to do. And I'm really, really good at that. So I can break opponents down like super, super fast. Obviously, I'm talking about foot champs specifically. So if I can't break them down quick enough, then I know I'm not, I'm going to struggle to break them down. So that's the only problem with my game right now. We come up against another team. I don't know why I put this part in. I think I should have cut it out but we do come up against another team every team i've come up against so far has been decent but not crazy crazy good this team is th th that team is fantastic you can't deny that's a fantastic team all around team great midfield great attack and solid 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 defense could have a better center back in keen maybe a, go a better goalkeeper but i heard joe hart's pretty good so um yeah that's not too bad but there's something about this team i think i i will title this um this this episode i made a mistake and i did I made a mistake. I <laughs> the mistake I did. Look at that by Marcos Alonso. It leads to a goal, by the way. Look at this. Sweats it, and I lose one nil in his only shot. I'm pretty sure in the whole game or something like that. And Song gets like a 7.1. His Song, so he gets his really, 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 really lucky goal in the freaking whatever minute that is, 90th minute. Um, what was I talking about? I don't remember, but. We go into the next game, right here, we come up against a solid, solid team with Cristiano Bale, Royce leading the front line, Vidal, Boateng, Alaba, Ramos, uh, Neuer, Alaba, and Casemiro. It's a very solid team, not a weakness in the team, except, okay, I guess I skipped that. I guess I skipped that, okay. The gameplay just cut off right there. We're, we're going into the next team, we're going into the next team. That's a fan, that's an insane team. Insane, ridiculous, crazy, except bad stuber. What is Bad Super doing there? I don't know. I'm, I'm pretty sure he just like said, okay, I just want to get Nord to full chem. And Mertens is the strongest player in the game. If you guys want a target man striker who's the strongest player in the game, get Trace Mertens. Get Trace Mertens. He held off. I think that was Marcos Alonso as if he was a little feather. Trust me. Trust me. Mertens is just a bully on the pitch. But we go down 2-1. I was talking about Petit being a mistake. I just remembered. Okay, so Petit was a mistake. Let's talk about why. Okay, I'm not, I'm not going to say, oh, this player is bad, this player is bad. I say a lot of players are bad, but it's mostly because of the bad gameplay, not because of me, or or it's mostly be because of the bad gameplay and me. It's not necessarily because the player as a card is bad. Look at this part, by the way. Uh, I, I want to talk about, this is why I hate Petit. I know it says I, I changed, but... I did press B, I did, I did, but I was Chris Smalling and it auto switched me to Emmanuel Petit. So I had already pressed B as Smalling, but it switched me to Emmanuel Petit, so registered as Emmanuel Petit, who is right next to the player, tackles him and he scores the penalty and wins the game in the 90th minute from a penalty. So yeah, Emmanuel Petit, not good. He, he, okay, let me, let me, let me, let me rephrase that. Emmanuel Petit is fantastic. He's great. At breaking up play he's good at passing he's good at winning headers most of the time but his work rates for a CDN or a center mid that you want to be defensive are horrific 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 his high high work rates are so detrimental so detrimental to the team he shoots up to the, to the striker position and then it takes him forever to get back and it makes me so mad because he's my only defensive midfielder, my true defensive midfielder in the team. And you're probably thinking, okay, so if you're saying all this stuff about Petit, you probably sold him already. You probably sold him in this episode sometime. Okay, that's cool. No, I can't because if I sell Mano Petit, it's going to be even more detrimental to the team because then I would have to sell. Look at this. Look at that. I hate this goal. I hate this goal because Smalling should have got in there and Alonso should have got in there. But it auto-switched me and it's somehow my fault because the game auto switch me what are you gonna do i don't know what's this by the way oh yeah 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 i just lose there too it's, it, it's okay it's okay I, I love losing anyway um i think we see a record in the next clip but manu petit 
he gets uh, Neymar onto full camp and he gets Usman Dembele, that's strong link. So I have to keep Emmanuel Petit in the center midfield spot. I don't want to. I have to keep Pogba at the right center mid. I, I, I'm, I'm, I'm three in seven. Three, oh, my computer just turned off. Okay. I'm three in seven. Oh, I think it turns off after 10 minutes. I'm three in seven after 10 games. After 10 games, I'm three and seven. That's pathetic. That is so bad for the team I have. I have what? One, two. I have two gold cards in my team. Two gold cards because my back, I have team of the season Lloris, Bellerin, Gbana, team of the season Marcus Alonso, Pogba, Emmanuel Petit, legend, players Mondelli Alley, team of the season Dembele. Uh, 94 Suarez, who's the SBC, and then I have the 94 Neymar team of the group stage. I think that is her team of the knockout stage. I don't freaking care who it is, but I have two gold cards, and they're super overpowered, of course. Pogba and Smalling, great cards, four gold cards, and I can't win a game. And this is the team I switched to because I feel like I, I it, it counters the high pressure that I'm having to deal with. And I'm like, okay, great, this team's gonna be great, it's gonna be better than the 4 3 3 defensive. And then we come up against this team. This team should be a team I have. This, These are the teams I have to beat. If I don't beat these kind of teams, I'm not going to get anywhere. Breaks through with Bale and gets a goal in what? Is that the second minute? I think that's the second minute. It, it, it frustrates me watching this back because I shouldn't have lost most of, this, most of these games. But the team just doesn't mesh well. There's something about it that doesn't mesh well. Don't get team of the season Marcos Alonso either. That's another mistake I made. I made. Um, that's why I'm trying to finish my games as soon as possible so I can sell the whole team and just get 2 million coins because that's how much this team will be worth. Um, don't get team of the season Marcos Alonso. It, just get the regular 79 Alonso, the left that the left wing back upgraded one. He's just as good. He 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 his pace. It, it's the same. It's honestly the same. His physical is the same. His dribbling is probably a bit different. It probably feels a bit better on the ball. His defending is probably a bit better, but most of the time with that physical Marcus Alonso, it's just going to be just as good for that 79 and 250,000 coins for a left back. Not worth it. Not, not, not worth it. I think I do a replay here because I couldn't believe how he say how this didn't go in. Suarez misses that. Neymar, I'm like, sweet, I got the goal. Psych! Nava saves it with his knee. I come up against another team. Musa, San, Martial. One special card, rest gold cards. Super cheap, super easy team to beat. I thought. Did I think right? We're going to find out. I think this is going to be the, mo the, the happiest I've been this whole video because it just seems like I'm complaining and I'm not. Or maybe I am. But I'm just justifying why I, I, I just want to be I just want to be successful in the series. I just want to be successful in the series. That's all I want, man. I want to bring you guys good rewards and I can't when this game is just so trash at times. I'm not going to make excuses anymore. I'm going to go play. I'm not going to record. I, I think I am going to record. I'm just going to record because screw it. This guy rage quits. This will be the end of the video. Hope you guys did enjoy my 13 minute commentary, man. I need to go get a drink of water. 12 games played. Four games won, eight lost. We're going to bring this back, man. I know we will. Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you guys for sticking around. Leave a like, comment, and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. Have a fantastic day. And I'm out.